Welcome to another great day of teaching and learning. I'm Devon. And I'm Denzaria. And we're your anchors for today's news show. Before bringing you the top news, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for the school creed. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. for a moment of silence reflection to reflect upon today's activities. You may be seated. The character word for the month is forgiveness. The, the, the word forgiveness comes from the old English word forgiven, which means to give up. Forgiveness is of recognizing the problem and all the pain that and hurt that comes with it. And then choosing to let go of any bitterness, anger, and desire for, for revenge so that you can move on with life. Students that choose to forgive work through the process of making things right and try to restore friendships. Our, our I will statement of the day is, is repeat after me, I will I will choose to forgive. Choose to forgive. This does not mean that the offender will become a close friend. This does but it does mean that you will let go of the bitterness. The the month of February is a is is the time our nation set aside to acknowledge and celebrate Black History. Black History Month is an opportunity to em, to emphasize the history and achievements of African Americans. The Hope Hill family will celebrate back history in a variety of ways to acknowledge and empower and empower all us all. On this day in black history, baseball catcher Elston Jean Howard was born in St. Louis, Missouri in 1965. Howard signed a $70,000 contract with the New York Yankees and became the highest paid player in the in the history of baseball at the time in 1929. Oh, what a day in black history. In keeping with our Black History Month and our college and our in the clusters college and career theme, we'd like to spotlight the historically black college or university. The HBCU of the day is Clark Atlanta University. Clark Atlanta University or CAU was established in 1988 by the consolidation of Atlanta University. Clark Atlanta is one of the nation's foremost research, research institutions offering students from around the United States and several foreign countries the, the opportunity to engage in 38 exciting areas at the bachelor's, master's, and doctoral levels. Located in the historic heart of Atlanta, 3,500 students have access to academic and co-curricular experiences from forensic debate to on-air broadcasting to cancer research with world-renowned investigators, and so much more. From the arts to zoology, CAU combines nearly 300 years of tradition with a solid focus on academic excellence to produce leaders who will shape the future of the global community. People that have attended Clark Atlanta University 
including and Ralph Abernathy, Eva Marcio, Manuel Lewis, Bobby V, and Mays, to name a few. Other people that you may know that attended CAU include our very own Miss Battle, Miss Cooper Owens, Miss Hardaway, Miss Nakima Jones. Clark Atlanta University is our HBCU of the day. And now for the morning announcement. Today is Thursday, February 23rd, 2017. Bricks for Kids is in Mental Fitness will meet today in the Media Center at 2.45 p.m. If you have a signed permission slip, please plan to attend. The Girls on the Run will meet in the Support Services Office from 2.45 to 4 o'clock p.m. Please come dressed and ready to run. Don't forget Thursday folders go home today. And now for birthdays. Happy birthday to Ariel and Danielle Jones. Deontay Swinger, and Nathaniel Reynolds. We hope you enjoy your special day. Please come to the office to receive your birthday prize. Those are all the announcements that we have for today, and it's time for us to sign off. But remember our eagle expectation. Be, be respectful, respectful, be, be prepared, prepared, be safe, be, be proud. proud. Stand by for additional announcements from the front office.